This song is Jingle Bells. Jingle Bells, relatively basic for your chords, although you will use your C chord, you will use a G chord, you will use a three string A chord, you will use a D chord. But the new thing about this song is called first and second endings. When you play the song, you won't go this fast. You end it this way the first time. But then you go back to the beginning and play again. And now jump over the first ending, because we've done that already, and end it a new way. There's a nice explanation of that in your lesson book. It has arrows and, and how it all works out. So it simply means that you end it this way the first time, play again, and then jump over that and end it the new way the second time. So here is the chord version of Jingle Bells. One, two, three, four. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Change chords. Oh, what fun it is to ride one horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Change. Second ending, one horse open sleigh. Wanted to sing the melody for you so you see how the strumming is not at the speed of the melody. It's a background part, it's the accompaniment. It accompanies the melody. Now I'm going to play the melody for you. Nothing new in the melody, it's all based on G, A, B, C. D. Okay, one, two, three, four. Here's the first ending. the first ending, play the second ending. Notice my fingers are in ready position all the time. Here is Jingle Bells, the melody one more time. One, two, three, four. And now here is the chord version of Jingle Bells one more time. One, two, three, four. Jingle bells, jingle bells.